Awesome, awesome. Okay, so just a quick recap of some of the events that went on this week. Or month in game. Uh, a, so a giant tsunami took out the uh, southern defenses where the disfavored company had set up um, between 12.05 and I think that's 09.06. And, or, I don't know, whatever that one is. Um, huge tsunami went through and took out uh, most of their defenses set up. They're still set up on the northern pass and they're still fighting going on in the southern path, uh, pass, but there's a lot of confusion going on currently. Because of that, uh, Kragno Carnate, uh, who had recently been setting up expeditions into the uh, the southeast corner of the Waste of Time, actually landed a large military force in the southern east corner of Calimate. Um, they haven't disclosed why they're there. Uh, it's not sure whether it's there out of support for Calimate or if they're taking advantage of the situation. That is for all y'all to decipher. And then in Thaldori Reformed, along the uh, eastern edges, uh, there's been rising reports of more and more missing or missing people. Uh, yeah, showing up. Um, Nobody's entirely sure why. Alan Holly, uh, the prison up here in the top left corner, has reported that they uh, that they found their escaped convict. Uh, he was hiding out in the Barrens of Whitosh. So those are the major events that happened over this week <clears throat> that we had talked about in Discord. All right, so on to new stuff. Over in Pathrax, um, there seems to be a, a growing sentiment uh, towards towards peace, and a large group of young people from both the industrialists and the mages uh, factions are floating around the idea of coming together to work and try to create a new city where that blends industrialism and magic. Piracy is still continuing south of the Collective and is starting to become a large worry in that region between Befrelena, Alawaste, the Collective, and Kalintra. Kalintra is doubling down on their, uh, their patrols, and every fleet that's leaving from their shores, to and from their shores, uh, now has an armed escort due to the issues going on out there. Then, let me check real quick, because even though I made them, I get two of these nations always mixed up. So, do 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 do. Oops, too far. Um, well, obviously, uh, then Jorman Turner is still continuing their, uh, their coastal raids through Sigvinsur Faldor and the Faldori Plains, and they're starting to work their way uh, south along the coastline there. Okay, and then large um, incursions are going from Gentricar into Venchkala. This has been going on for decades. But the most recent, um, these most recent attacks are larger than in previous history. All right. Um, and I think that is most of the news for this week. Um, got some exciting stuff coming up this week. This was going to be a real quick one. Does anybody have any questions so far? Is there any indication of where the pirates are coming from? Any nationality, ethnicity for the ones that have been defeated or captured? Uh, no, it seems uh, to be a, a a collection. There's no indicator. And they're all alive? Um, they're undead pirates? 
Well, unless you have taken pirates yourself, I can't answer that. Fair enough. All right. Um, so, to kind of summarize big stuff that's going on, Calimate is in a very uncomfortable position with the mercenaries they just hired being taking a large loss and now it's very worrisome with the dragonkin out of Cragno Carnate landing on their shores. Um, peace looks like it's on the horizon out in Pathrax. Uh, although there is still there's still have been no uh, uh, repercussions from uh, the explosion that happened on the last peace conference. Piracy is up. Missing people in Faldori were formed. Coastal raids going on on the east coast out of Jorman Turner and Gentriker uh, leading large incursions into Venshkala. All right. I got some exciting stuff planned uh, for you this week. What's happening where? Talnor. Talnor. That was a conflict zone a week or two. It's a continual conflict zone. Because Central Faldor and um, Faldori Reformed have been fighting this ongoing war for hundreds of years, Talnor is always caught more or less in the midst of it just because of the natural formations here because there's one pass between those countries, uh, between the mountains. Ooh. So they are still struggling, but they did get a... Uh, there was a wave of relief of efforts from nations around the world that kind of helped them um, keep beating their people. Alrighty. Well, uh, unless there's any further public questions, uh, we're going to call it there. And uh, remember, guys, it's this is... This is up to you. Um, I can only do so much to uh, get you playing. Uh, be inquisitive. Ask questions. Super open-ended game, right? Um, your guys' response shouldn't necessarily be just reactionary. Ask me questions. Ask me about your neighbors. Go and fuck with your neighbors if you want. Like, it's totally up to you. I, I do. Yeah, that's what I like doing. That's where the fun stuff happens. All right, but uh, yeah, we'll call it there and stop the recording.